We are here at the Soundchat movie premiere of the Bob Marley movie, and as you can see, them come prepared, you know, matching shirt and yeah, it's nice. One, one love, watch the, watch the ear. Sass. See, you see, you can see the love is in the ear already. Huh? Is there anything that you guys hoping or expecting to see in this movie? Well, I am hoping for a true depiction, depiction, sorry, of, of Bob's life. Mm -hmm. um, the humble beginnings that he started from and the message that he has throughout the years shared not only with Jamaica but with the world. He has represented well, mm -hmm. represented well. Even in time of defeat and all of that where he was challenged, he went, reflected and he came back stronger and powerful. Mm -hmm. So that is what I really am looking forward to seeing in this the true depiction of who the man himself the legend was what about you well i've known i've read i've seen mm -hmm. and now is my now is my chance to actually see a live picture depicting all his you know his life so let's see let's see i'm let's waiting to see. see yes absolutely yes. all right Just well done guys thank you thank you man pleasure is mine <laughs> We are, we are at the Bob Marley premiere, you know, one of our legends are of a movie in a movie theater. So, is there an expectation from you guys what you want to see and hope to see in the movie? Well, I've been a Bob Marley fan forever. Mm -hmm. So, expectation, I would say just a good movie. You know, just to enjoy and, and look at the legend. <laughs> and, you know, that's Anything it. No, just excited. Just excited. Yeah. All right, man. All right, go on. <laughs> this is Soundchat Radio, Soundchat TV. Um, we're going to see the Bob Marley movie for the first time after so many years. MG, one are we? A legend of one of us. A movie, a big screen. We're not getting a small screen. We get big screen. You know what I mean? So we're proud of that, right? But is there any expectation you have for this movie? Well, I do hope. You know, I'm from Guyana. Mm -hmm. I'm a event host educator and um, I do hope it relates directly to Bob Marley because everything that Bob Marley did in his life it relates to what's going on around the world if you listen to his music it's, it's, it's it sends a message and I'm looking forward to at least they come close to what he lived for sound chat TV sound chat radio we're there with one of our radio host you know they call him the gangster pastor He's a pastor, but also a gangster with the Bible in his hand. You know what I mean? So, so one hand. What? <laughs> what well, well, are So for the... let me ask you a question. Yes, now. Sir. What, what do you expect a Bob Marley movie? Well, you know, I expect the best, just mm -hmm. because it's Bob Marley. You know, mm -hmm. as a preacher, mm -hmm. I have often quoted Bob Marley in my sermon. You know, um, until the color of a man's skin is of no more significance than the color of his eyes, there will be war, which is actually a quote from Haile Selassie, mm -hmm. Geneva Conference, but um, you know, just I'm not. A lot of people think that you know I'm religious, but I'm not. I'm righteous, and Bob Marley sing a lot of righteous songs, and even the one where he said he feel like bombing a church. Mm -hmm. If you listen carefully to why he wants to bomb the church, is that he found out that the preacher was lying, mm -hmm. and then you know it's now justifiable, I guess, and of course it's symbolic. I'm, I'm not really want to bomb the church, and mm -hmm. I too find that a lot of preacher is lying. So. Yeah. I identify with Bob in a lot of things, so I look forward to this movie. But we know why you bombed the movie, though. No, 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 not taking the movie. Enjoy the movie. I mean, but if the movie is good, I'm gonna say the movie was the bomb. Right. All right. right. <laughs> we are here with this lady in a nice red, gold, and green. That she come prepared to support Bob Marley movie, right? Absolutely, absolutely. No, that come prepared. What do you expect to see from the movie? I expect to see things about Bob Marley that I've not, that I don't know. Mm -hmm. Um, we want some of you know, do we want, of course, of mm -hmm. course, we want to see some authentic side of um Bob Marley. Mm -hmm. I want to see how he started mm -hmm. and who helped him to climb the ladder. Mm -hmm. I want to see all of that. Right. I don't want anything to be excluded mm -hmm. because then it would not be who Bob was, mm -hmm. yeah. And I don't think I'm just saying I don't think he would want anything to be excluded. He you would want everybody to know that. This is what his life is. This is what he stands for. And um, yeah, I want to see everything. So you're excited? I'm absolutely excited. You know, some colors. You see it, man. You're going to be prepared. Ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Right. ready. So ready. Big up, Soundchat. Wait a when, when the movie done, we're going to 
run you down and say you don't have to run me down I'm gonna me. be I'll be here right. <laughs> <laughs> so we are at the Bob Marley Music Affair the music party I know when we, I we, 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 we strong radio host, the elder, you know, reasoning with the elder, check him out on Soundchat Radio. I said, Elder, yes, sir. what is your expectation of this Bob Marley movie? Well, first of all, I expect great cinematography. Mm -hmm. I want to see our people mm -hmm. looking great. Mm -hmm. Because for too long, when they take our picture and films and so forth, they look too hot. Right. So I expect great cin we cinematography. We need to look good. Yes, sir. Okay. And I expect for them to to delve into Bob, right. who Bob really was, what yeah. he meant to us as a people, yeah. right? And I, I, I'm, I'm hoping, that's why I come to see, to make sure that they did the right thing, right? right? So that's what all Jamaican is here for, to see that justice was done to Bob. Well, we only going to know until we, uh, uh, unless we see the movie, right? That's why I'm here. So we'll see the movie, we can tell. Yes. All right, Elder, all right. we, we so, talk later. Right. All right. <laughs> The Soundchat Radio Bob Marley movie party was phenomenal. So many people turned out that we had to end up using two theaters instead of one, right? It, you know, it, 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 was, it was just a vibe, right? You know, proud Jamaicans, proud West Indians, proud black people came out to understand. And some people came out to relive, right? Because a lot of people, you know, they were around and, you know, they were you know, that age that Bob was during the time of Bob's reign, right? So some people came to relive that time. Others came to learn about it. People just came to enjoy the vibe and the music. A lot of people came in suspense, right? Because some people wanted to see if the acting was going to be good. They wanted to see what the storyline was going to be. Um, the reviews are good so far. So again, you know, Soundchat Radio, we're doing our thing. We're out in the streets, man, and we're making it happen. Here comes some more people, and I'm going to interview all of them um, about what they witnessed tonight how did you enjoy the show love it absolutely love it. it was emotional it was really really good i'm so proud of that main character he did a great job i'm so proud of my people i love it so it lived up to your expectations it really did it really did it shows us a side of bob that we never really knew you know just knowing that he could rise to greatness in such a short life and just believe in what he believed in unequivocally he believed in it i want to catch some of you com coming out how did you enjoy it Rudy? Absolutely wonderful. I really enjoyed it. Having lived through it, um, you know, to see it in screen was just wonderful. It's special. Great. Thanks. How did you feel about it? That movie was beautiful. I it. cried five times. <laughs> How did you feel about the movie? Yeah, man. The, the movie, man, man. Movie, man. Man, 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 man. Big up the morning crew. You feel me? I said. How did you enjoy the movie? Yeah, man. Movie good. Up, you know? Yeah, man. Bless the love so. Did it live up to your expectations? Yes, man. Everything was expected. Everything was, Everything was expected. How did you enjoy the movie? It was really good. It was really good. I Acting? Mean, it was like everything was good. Cinematography. I liked it. Costume. How did you guys enjoy? I enjoyed it. It was really good. They did a good job. Good acting? Um, pretty good. <laughs> How did you enjoy it? It was good. I liked it. Really liked it or just liked it? I really liked it. Oh, nice, nice, nice. How did you enjoy the movie? It was real good. Yeah, yeah, I liked it. I liked it. Slick old Bob Guan, talk to me. I'm the real skipper. Bob Guan with him things, man. Trust me, the move was superb. Excellent. Excellent. Excellent movie. To the world. To the world. To the world. Something to be proud of. Very proud. I am proud of it. Soundchat Radio, of course, we're covering the uh, Bob Marley premiere, our Bob Marley premiere here um, in New York. How did you like the movie? Fantastic, man. Educational. I loved it. What was the greatest part about it for you? Uh, I didn't know so much about how he interacted with his family and how he kind of helped everybody and took care of the community. So that was a learning experience for me. Uh, nice. Thank you. Thank you for coming. How did you like the movie? Very good. Very good. Interesting, especially for the young people to see how you grew up. How did you like the movie? It was absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. What I find right now is that I feel like I've gone back into my culture. I want to go and look for all my red, gold, and green. But I learned a lot from this movie. And I sat there, I watched everything, wanted to see who I knew from Jamaica. It was just different. It was just, I feel a sense of pride. You're proud, you're proud. How did you like the movie? Fantastic, great. No complaints? No. How did you like the movie? Movie nice, movie nice. No complaints? 
Well, we want to, we figure say, Bob should be a more Jamaican actor. Yeah. Jano. But the, he do a good job. Do him thing? Yeah, he do a good job. Yeah. yeah. How did you enjoy the movie? Oh, the movie was excellent, man. I just wish it was uh, more, you know, more of the story. We wanted more at the end, but it was a really good, um, uh, you know, what do you call it? Representation, you know? So it was good. Is there anything you thought was missing? Hi, I'm Queenie Mother. Hi, Queenie, I Mommy. I enjoyed the music. You very good. It? Yes, very much. How did you enjoy it? I enjoyed it very much, very much. Was there anything missing for you or did you get everything you wanted? Um, I wanted more of the background, <laughs> like the background, his history, but it was good. The music was good. And like the, his family like aspect of it, it was good. Good acting, bad acting, talk to me. It was good acting, you know, but still I wanted more uh, as far as his um, growing up, you know, more of, you know, his, his uh, youth. What did you feel about the movie? Well, well, it was it it, it, it it was very moving in terms of bringing Rastafari to the main screen. But no, that's so well. One one time we never have this audience and this nation of people who are gravitate. I want to know what Rastafarian is all about, and them could have really bring a movie to fusion. That's we you know have something, and we can't talk about and bring it to even the younger generation because right now. Watching this movie, we have, we have and, and having give thanks to you who can create a program right now that we can all broadcasters can bring something to the table and bring nation because this is going to bring nations of people, black, brown, and white. That's why when the king said the color of a man's skin is of no more significant than the color of his eyes, so all of these things are going to come into fusion that's bring nation together and try bring about world peace because. In our legacy, get understanding. So we have something we can work on, and we have something we can take to nation of people, black, brown, or white. Mm -hmm. So we're glad. So we're over the hump of color, class, and creed, and can have some dialogue, have some dialogue with some people who don't really understand what is going on within the within within the world community. So we give thanks, give thanks to Sound Chat Radio, to the diaspora. Another good one. Yes, yes. Another good one. Yes.